got a uh, mark on a form of tether. And the best way to describe this reach aid is a, a shepherd's hook. So we're able to uh, grab around the casualty and then uh, pull them out of the bateau. So again, very, very similar to the buoyancy aid on the line. It's a little bit light. So we hold on to uh, these sorts of reach aids and pull a casualty out of the bateau. So it's quite important that you know, as a casualty, you can kind of get inside, you can see Graham now, so get inside that P-shape and it makes it easy for it to hold on to and get the clear. And the added advantage is well, and then extend the reach aids over the bar line into the hydraulic to rest of the casualty. So that in fact gives our separation. Moving upstream. As to recover very really difficult in this instance to keep that trim on the boat, um, but prior to this you can see that John was certainly endeavouring to keep that boat nice and flat, to keep the, the loading off our B-layers. <coughs> boat being recovered to ribbon there. adjustment on our up and down line. Boat position just below the boy line. And then again, as we saw before, um, using that reach shape to reach over the top of the boy line and bring the casualty into the water. So a different tactic this time, bringing the casualty onto the side of the boat so it actually keeps the boat nice and level and keeps that loading of our track line to a minimum. Best option here, obviously, to move downstream and wait for.